keeping our planner dry, even though there's that chance of that shower or storm. Again, very low for this morning. 80 degrees though at noon. 85 later on those winds out of the south southeast uh, definitely lighter about five to ten miles per hour throughout the overnight partly cloudy 61 degrees it's all we drop back to as in we could be potentially breaking some records so today forecast 85 the records 85 a uh, setback the year i was born 1993 so it's been a while uh, but we could tie that or go above that and that's the case for the next several days so definitely some unusual temperatures that we're not used to seeing we're going to stay dry though when we start to try to attempt to tie or break those records as our next rain chance doesn't arrive until Saturday. Cold fronts coming through, so we could see some showers and storms, I think Saturday afternoon and evening. And then we can hold on to some shower chances as then we go throughout the rest of the weekend on Sunday. Of course, as you can see here on Future Track, more so hit or miss behind that first push of that cold front. Today, very low shower and storm chance to start for the day. I think mainly dry for everyone much of the day. 84 or 85 then on Friday. As we go into the weekend, there is that chance of showers again. Saturday evening, I think the best chance of those showers and storms. And then it slowly diminishes as we go throughout the weekend and into next week. But our temperatures diminish as well. Dipping back into the 70s and 60s behind that system. I think we're going to stay there the next 8 to 14 days. Climate Prediction Center just putting us on the edge of cooler and average temperatures. But remember, our average daytime high, 68 degrees. And honestly, the 60s, 70s, we'll take them, even though this week is definitely very warm.